Good afternoon, everybody. Mr. Hamid, Wisdom School. Uh, well, another course of conditionals, but before that, please stay at home and stay safe. If you go out, you are threatening the future of Morocco. Threaten is head dead. Threatening. You threaten your family, you threaten your friends, your grandparents, your parents, and you know it's contagious. Contagious means uh, it's very dangerous for all the country. We are on the same boat. We are on the same boat. It means uh, a boat or a canoe. It's like this. And we are here. We are all on or in the same boat means uh, we've got to take care of each other. Please stay at home. Another course of conditionals. Today it's conditional type uh, 3. Conditional type 3. Conditional type 1, the future. Type 2, the present. And type 3, the past. The sentence is here, example. We didn't study yesterday because the teacher was sick. We didn't study and the teacher was sick. The verb to be in the past. If, if, uh, conditional type 3, it's if plus the verb in the past perfect. Past perfect. So, we didn't study yesterday because the teacher was sick. If the teacher, what's past perfect of the verb to be? What is past perfect? You know what past perfect? Okay. Past perfect is had plus past participle. Past participle, regular, irregular. Visit, had visited. Be, had been. Go, had gone. Visit, had visited, watch, had watched, wash, had washed, etc. So, uh, we didn't study yesterday because the teacher was sick. If the teacher uh -huh, had, hadn't, negative, very good, hadn't been sick, if the teacher hadn't been sick, you can usted makan shmaret makan it means negative. If the teacher hadn't been sick, we could or would or might have studied yesterday. So. The form is if plus past perfect, past perfect. What is past perfect? It's had plus past participle. Plus, sorry, can I erase the date? I will do. Okay, so if plus past perfect plus would or could or might plus have plus past, past participle. The sentence again. If the teacher hadn't been sick, hadn't been, sorry, hadn't been, it's the verb to be in the past participle. Uh, past perfect, sorry. We could, ha could, have, could, have, and this is a past participle of the verb study, because it's a regular. I didn't call you because I forgot. I didn't call you because I forgot. Lucan Mansic. Okay, good. So we say, if I hadn't forgotten, if I hadn't forgotten, I could have called you. But I, I forgot. Uh, my uh, friends didn't visit me because they traveled. My friends didn't visit me because they traveled. We'll say, if my friends hadn't traveled, if they hadn't uh, traveled, I, sorry, they would have visited me. They would have visited me or they might have visited me. Next sentence. My mother gave me pocket money, so I bought a laptop. My mother gave me money, I buy, in the past I bought. What's the verbs? My mother gave me and I bought. So the sentence will be, if my mother 
hadn't. Give. Give in the past. Gave, past participle, given. The list. The list. The list. Have the list. Irregular verbs. Yes, at home. Take us that. Have the list. Be, was, were, been. Go, when, gone, see, saw, seen, buy, bought, bought. Okay, give, gave, given. If my mother hadn't given me uh, pocket money, I would, I could, I might, help had the same. Could, would, might are the same. I uh, might have bought a laptop. What is the problem here? There is a problem. Uh, if my mother hadn't given me pocket money, I might not, because negative. You can matatnish, maimkinsh, maanshirish, negative form. I might not have bought a la laptop. Next one. He drove carelessly. Carelessly, it's okay, he drives crazily. So he killed a small boy. If. Let's say if in the middle. Here. Sorry. If. Like this. If he hadn't driven carelessly, if he hadn't driven carelessly, he uh, could, negative, couldn't have killed a small boy. So he couldn't have killed a small boy if he hadn't driven carelessly. Negative. If he had driven slowly, he couldn't have killed a small boy. The next sentence. Ali stole a bike. The police arrested him as a result. Arrested. They arrested him. The criminal ran and the police, up, oh, they arrested him. Ali stole a bike. The police arrested him. If Ali hadn't steal, stole, stolen, ah, irregular, good. If Ali hadn't stolen a bike, that's a bike. If Ali hadn't stolen a bike, come on, because I've in the beginning, the police, not the police, the pol police. There's a schwa between, so we don't say po police, we say po police. The police uh, could or would, negative, wouldn't have arrested him. Again the sentence. If Ali hadn't stolen a bike, the police wouldn't have arrested him. Negative form, negative form. I repeat the sentences. I repeat. We didn't study yesterday because our teacher was sick. If the teacher hadn't been sick, we could or we would or we might have studied yesterday. My mother gave me pocket money, so I bought a laptop. If my mother hadn't given me pocket money, I might have I might not, sorry, have bought a la laptop. The third one, he drove carelessly, carelessly, without uh, paying attention. He drove carelessly, so he killed a small boy. Where is the problem? It's in driving carelessly, it's okay? He couldn't have killed a small boy if he, had driven, if he hadn't driven carelessly. If we have here carefully, carelessly, with the Carefully, carefully, bihadar, carelessly, Moroccan drivers, some of them. If we have care carefully, we we'll see, he couldn't have killed a boy if he had driven carefully. He drives carefully, no victims. You drive crazily, lots of victims. This is a point for future generation. Please, when I have a driving license, drive slowly. And when you have 10 years experience, drive slowly too. A lot of Moroccans die. And sometimes we are responsible. At the present time, I will not speak about driving because you are supposed to be at home. I would just concentrate once more. Stay at home. 
We are here for you. All this. I am here in front of a camera and uh, a team. We are working all together so that you can stay at home and we can teach you, of course, with a great pleasure. Enjoy your day. Stay at home. Stay safe. And uh, see you next time. Thank you.